Hello, I'm Shadow Kavan. Welcome back to some more door kickers. So this has gone in 50 seconds. Uh, an arrest warrant mission. Let's jump straight in. So there's a couple of cars, just a normal looking house. Four troopers and the rescue zone is right down the bottom on a boat. So let's um I'm assuming we're going with two assaults and two point men again, that's fine. Let's jump straight in here. Right, so we need to get this guy here, this guy watching down here. And we'll clear this room out first. And there's a couple of windows I'm going to look through before I enter the actual house. So what we'll do is move this guy here. I don't want to get him in the line of sight of the window to clear this bloody hell. Clear this room out of this bloke. You could all source killed all three dudes. That's quite cool. Um, right. So there's my target, and there's all the bad guys. These doors are open, so what we'll do is jump straight in here. This guy's going to wait here. And Luigi's on the run, so we're going to try and cut him off, I think. Actually, why don't I cut him off this way? Surprise, asshole. Oh. He's trying to hide behind some bloke, but... That's not going to fly, is it? So I'm going to move this guy around here. Ah, shit, he managed to take one of our men down. Let's restart. That seemed to go pretty well uh, so far. Well, kind of, anyway. To a certain extent, it went pretty well. <clears throat> went, uh, right, so this guy's going to come in here. Take all three, three of those blokes out. He did get hit this time, whereas last time he didn't, but not the end of the world. And all three guys are dead. So Luigi isn't in this room this time, so we need to go hunt for him. So we're going to move this guy around. This guy can move in, and this guy can move in here as well. This guy can come around the, the side. Luckily, this dude here, there's a bad guy just here. Sh Never mind. Shooting at the other trooper, but he managed to shoot me in the back. So there we go. So let's try this a third time. Third time lucky. Eh? There's only two bad guys in there. So there's actually less bad guys now. Oh, and there's Luigi, but he's making a run for it. Annoyingly. But I reckon... We can catch him. Ah, oh, shit, the guy with the shotgun. I keep forgetting about him. So if I angle him up here, actually, he'll be able to see down properly. Before, before I actually enter the room. With the guy waiting to ambush me. So this guy can run. Actually, no, he can't because he'll get shot through the window running before I start. Although, in a minute, we can just tend to move to the window. So, this guy's going to come here. Send A up here. And hopefully... Oh, no, a guy got killed this time. That's a bit of a bugger, isn't it? Uh, let's restart and try again. So, apparently, the third time was not lucky. <coughs> but, you know, we'll eventually get there. So, actually, what I need to do is... If I move this guy here and this guy to here... Straight away... And pop this guy here. Hopefully take out the guy with the shotgun. He did shoot me, but we did manage to uh, take him down. Which is quite lucky for us. So move this guy this way. This dude's going to move in here as well. So just going to watch our backs in case anyone tries to come through this door, which they are. Oh, and there's a bl bloke sneaking around the back who got shot off the window. By the trooper I accidentally left there, so that's quite handy. All we'll do is make this guy look down here, make sure there's no bad guys there. So I can check this room out. Ah, right. We found Luigi. He's in there. So I can send this dude in to grab him. This guy can wait in the corridor here. So the Cooper bag on here. Hopefully he won't he won't come out and get us. Shit. Oh no, we did kill him. That's good for us. And it was a bag on there, which we managed to take out as well, which is quite handy. So we just need to clear this. And bring this guy around. And oops. Get these dudes from behind, that's quite good. Right, now this bloke can... We can run him out pretty safely, I think. And just watch our backs. So whilst he's making his way out... <coughs> we're just sitting here, hope... Um, yeah, we're just sitting here... Waiting for any more bad guys to pop out from somewhere. But I don't think there are any left. Unless there's a guy hiding in the toilet just here. Or a bloke around the back. But I think we did actually manage to take him out. And there we go. So, that's quite a fun mission, actually. 
So that's mission complete. Oh, three seconds. And, the, and there was one hustle less. There must have been hustle in that toilet. So we were three seconds off. So never mind. Let's have a look at this this mission. So I believe this is actually the very last level. Rainy night on Venice Hill. I'm going to jump straight in and give it a go. And this might go into the next video. Yeah, so it's pretty good. So there's quite a lot of windowed rooms down here. And there's a little wall separating. This is... Uh, what is this? This is a hostage rescue mission. So there's a hostage here. I'm imagining, I'm imagining there's going to be a bit more than one. If you jump into the mission briefing, there's apparently four hostages. So there's at least one here. There's windows here which you can look through. And windows down here. So is it worth looking through the windows before we actually enter the property? Or do we send... Okay, so there's another doorway here actually as well. What we'll do is we'll send this guy through these windows, this guy through these windows, and the two point make an enter in just a minute. Let's do this. I'm on. So we'll take this guy around here, he's going to strafe the whole way. And this dude, whoops, around here, he's going to strafe the whole way as well. Uh, these doors are both locked, so for now I'm going to these guys to put breaching charges on them. But I won't actually breach until these guys have cleared these rooms out. So there's two, three bad guys dead here. There's no one in there. Oh shit, there's a fuck ton of bad guys in that room. So actually, we're going to reverse course. Oh no, he killed the hostages. Shit. So we're 35 seconds to beat his level. That seems pretty bad. Pretty harsh. So there are our operatives hanging around here. So we're going to... um. Let's deviate from our previous plan and go straight through here. We're going to bash these doors down this time, see how that goes. Jesus, so the, there's an operative there, so actually we're better off planting breach. I think we'll just plant breaching charges. We can blow both doors open and then rush through. So once this breaching charge is gone, you can move here and you can follow through this door and move down here. This bloke can move to here, and this guy can follow straight through to... Hmm. Got to be careful, there's a door here. Actually, I could... Is this locked? Ah, oh, this is locked. Actually, okay, what I'm going to do is move this guy around here. Breaching charge on that door. So we've got three entry points. Three doors are going to breach. <coughs> so on A, you guys can blow this open. Just when eventually this bloke actually gets here. And hopefully that'll manage to take out anyone that's kind of standing around these two doorways. So, A, let's uh, go, shall we? So everyone's gone in, so I think that may have been an op operative there we killed. I'm not 100% sure. So now what we'll do is move this guy into here. This guy's moving down here. This guy's moving here. I'll get both these dudes to plant breaching charge in these doors, I think. And watch this guy's back, because that dude's going to come through. And this door's actually already open with uh, with an operative just there, who might actually manage to rinse my troops. So move him in. And move this guy around here. Oops. So I think we might end up restarting this. Oh, actually, no. We managed to actually kill the somehow we managed to kill the operative without uh, getting ourselves killed. So we're just going to go and clear the rest of this out. So I send both these dudes around here in case there's another. Oops, like apparently can't walk around the sofa. So I send both these assault troops here in case there's another operative hiding in here. And we come here and then check this room out. There's no one in the bathroom and. So there's only a couple of rooms left, isn't there, really? Make sure you look that way, and then check this room out. Whereas both of these dudes are coming into this room here. Oh, no! Fuck! <laughs> Jesus, so... Good job. We managed to complete it. Took us ten seconds too long, and... Um, the dude with the shotgun killed us. So, fantastic. So we're going to go with a sim... Oh, bollocks. That means I do that. So we just lost two of my men because I went continue rather than restart. Uh, let's go back to the main menu. So that indeed was the last level, so 
we'll try this one again. So both our bloody dudes are now dead, which is mildly annoying. Uh, okay, so point man, point man, that's yes, fine. So what I should do this time is send this bloke around here to strafe and then back here through this door into here. This bloke's going to... Okay. Actually, no, I can't do that, can I? This bloke here is going to set a breaching charge. Right, let's delete this guy's thing. I'm start out again, shall we? So, all the way around there and then back down here. Uh, when you get to here, you can start strafing. And then strafe again. When you get back here, you can look that way and that's fine. So I might actually send this guy this... No, it seems like... Oh, I should have pop, popped in at the bottom, shouldn't I, really? So let's... No, that's fine. That's fine. Breaching charge here. Breaching charge just here. So we'll see how this goes. Apparently this bloke is still going through the doors first. So, breaching charge. I'm on. Uh, delete that. Strafe, and then all the way back this way. So hopefully, yeah, this guy's now placing a breach charge, which is good. The bad guy in there is dead as well. So a couple of these room doors have opened, so... Do you want to place both of these on A, and I'll place this on A as well. In a minute. So actually, I'm going to blow that breaching charge open, because... <coughs> And blow and blow. Apparently, didn't blow that one open. Blow today, maybe. Oh, never mind. So uh, our guy died. So we're going to restart that shit. So this wouldn't blow when I was clicking the blow button. I actually had to click on the door. So we move this guy down to here. Get him ready to breach. And you ready to shit. That's fine. So uh, in this case, actually, I'm not going to do that again. I'm going to. Or shall I? Going down there activated all the other bad guys in the level, which was a bit shit. But I'm going to do it anyway. And you can place a charge here as well. <clears throat> so I have all three charges placed. And move this guy and engage him. He's dead, so now this guy can come here. So as soon as this guy's in position, up here I can actually fire all three breaching charges off. So to do that, we'll set them to go code A. So, and then actually we'll just wait a couple of seconds for these guys to come to the doors. We'll enter all three dudes here. This guy can come around here. So actually we did manage to kill the operative. That was pretty damn good. And that guy over here is also dead. So check this room out. Uh, this guy can come here. This dude and this dude can both enter this room here. So we... And there's another, another operative. Fuck. So he killed two of our guys. So, um... Okay, so change your plan. Right, let's do try one more time. Slight change of plan. Yeah, that's fine, that's fine. You need to set a breaching charge on the door. And then move down here. This guy's gonna... Move to here, take these guys out, and then move into here whilst some other troops move in there as well. And take out, so that we can shoot the opportunity from two sides, I think is the best bet. So if I move this guy just to here, all these charges are ready to go, so we can blow these. So we managed to kill one operative straight away, which is really good. This guy can move here, this guy can move on the doorway, but not through it. This guy can come up to here. We'll move this guy around actually now. Um, we'll move into what this window here? No. Move this window here behind the tape. Shit. Oh, for fuck, feck sake. We managed, we've already lost two men in this mission anyway, so we'll see what we can do. Oh, sweet. Hostiles eliminated. So, I think we managed to kill the. Um, that last operative by shooting me in the back, where he obviously wasn't wearing any armour, so he'd actually managed to kill him. Uh, unfortunately, he did lose a troop, but 
through my own stupidity of clicking continue rather than restart, we lost actually three troops on that level. So, there we go. Anyway, thank you very much for watching me, and I shall see you in the next video.